today i came to visit manufacturing facility of colon so they are manufacturing electric loader vehicles here in cherlapalli hyderabad so basically this colon has 25 years plus experience in vein scale industry and with that experience they are into this electric vehicles manufacturing from past two years so from past two years they are doing r d on this electric loader vehicles and from past one year they are manufacturing this loader electric vehicles here in hyderabad so in this video let's know the complete details of this loader electric vehicle and one more thing they are offering free dealership opportunities also so in this video let's take a detailed tour of how these electric vehicles are made what are the specialties of these electric vehicles and what is the process to take that free dealership opportunity so before diving into the video this is aditya and you're watching electric vehicles india Let's start exploring the factory of this Colon with their own scooter. So this Colon Eloid Plus. So they are claiming 250 kg of load capacity on this loader electric vehicle. So here is the fabrication center of this factory. So the manufacturing of this electric scooter starts from the fabrication itself. So now let's go into the fabrication center and let's explore how the fabrication work will be done. Friends, this is the fabrication department of this call on EV. So they are manufacturing these electric scooters from the scratch. As you can see, these are the chassis of this call on loader electric vehicles. So basically, this chassis will be the main and first component when it comes to the manufacturing of any vehicle. So in India, most of the companies are importing these chassis from the other countries and they are assembling the remaining parts to their electric scooters. But this Hyderabad-based call on company are manufacturing chassis also in-house. So now let's see how this chassis will be made so let's see from where the chassis from where the manufacturing of this chassis will start so these are the rods and pipe through which they'll start manufacturing the chassis of this electric scooter from here they'll bend these pipes and they'll start making the chassis and as you can see these are all the remaining small components of this chassis and the final chassis will looks like this so all those pipes and rings will be bent as per the requirements of this electric scooter and they'll weld all these at once so like this they are manufacturing the chassis of this electric scooter here and the next department is assembling department after completion of the chassis this chassis will go to the assembling department and there the remaining electric scooter will be built now let's go to the assembling departments and let's see what are all the works has been taken there friends this is the assembling unit of this call on ev so the chassis will come here from the fabrication department and here all the remaining parts will be assembled to this chassis now let's talk to the assembling head of this call on ev and let's know how much time it will take and what are all the parts will go into it to complete this 100% product. So there we have the assembling head of this call on Heavy. Hi sir. Hello. So good name please. Vinod Raghav. Okay. So Mr. Vinod ji, please explain what are all the steps will go into it to become a final EV scooter. See basically we start from the chassis. Okay. After uh, chassis uh, completion, hmm. we fit uh, front fork. Okay. Front fork with the uh, front wheel. Okay. This wheel is already pre-assembled. Okay. So this uh, wheel along with the front fork, this will be fixed in the chassis. Okay. Then we will fix handlebar. Okay. After handlebar, we will fix center stand. Okay. And then swing arm. Done. And then rear wheel. Okay. Rear wheel with the help of sockers. Okay. So this is something a, a vehicle is able to stand on the conveyor. Yeah. After that, we start the wiring harnesses we place okay. as per the routing. Okay. And then we start uh, uh, the other parts. Okay. Like uh, in this vehicle, I will show you. Yeah. The seating uh, arrangement will come. Okay. And uh, electrical lights we will fix. Okay. Lights are fitted here. Okay. <clears throat> So can so, we say this as a 90% uh, ready model? Yes, 90% ready model. We okay. have to fix uh, uh, battery box okay. after that. Okay. And once battery box is fitted, then these uh, controller connections and power connections will be given to it. Done. Thank you. Zee. Thank you. So friends, this is the assembling point of this call on EV. Now let's move on to the battery department and let's check out how the batteries of this EVs are made. And let me say you, they are using LFP chemistry batteries in this call on electric vehicles. Now let's head to the battery department. So friends, this is the battery department of this call on EV. So before getting into it, here we have motor or controller testing jig. So on this jig, they will test the motor and controller. So as you can see, if I throttle, there the motor is running there with the help of the controller. So here they will test each and every motor and controller whether it is working fine or not. And next here we have the battery department. 
so this is the battery department of this Colon EV and they are using LFP battery chemistries in their electric scooters so with the help of this machine they'll charge and discharge and segregate each and every LFP battery cell over here as we all know from where we'll get all these batteries but whether these batteries each and every cell is working or not they'll test here so after completion of this charge and discharge test each and every cell of the battery will go into this IR testing so after successfully completion of this IR testing they'll go into the battery pack so they will arrange these each and every cell in the battery pack and after completion of this it will go to the spot welding so with the help of this machine so this authorized person will weld each and every battery into the battery pack so after completion of the welding it will go into battery pack capacity testing so they will attach the bms of the battery to the battery pack and they'll test the battery over here so this is the capacity testing machine of the battery pack so after completion of this capacity testing this battery pack will go into the casing so finally this is the ais 156 certified battery of this call on ev so this is the battery process the battery making and the assembling process of an electric scooter no company will show their battery department openly like this so i kind the openness of this call on heavy so friends as you saw these are the steps involved to make an electric scooter i think in india no brand will show their battery assembling unit to public kudos to call on ev for showing us their battery assembling unit now let's meet the executive director of this company and let's know about free dealership offer so friends here we have the executive director of this call on brand so let's talk with him now hi sir your good name please yeah i'm ratna raganla nice okay. meeting hi thank you sir so first of all you said me that you are offering free dealership opportunity to people so please let me know all the related details regarding it yeah uh, sure and definitely yeah. the dealership uh, we are providing free dealership okay. we are not collecting uh -huh. any deposit amount okay. because there are uh, already existing people uh -huh. they may uh, start uh, they can take our dealership uh -huh. and also the youth either ladies or gents can also have this okay. who are interested mm. but they cannot invest on deposit mm. there were some companies they are collecting mm. 2 lakhs to 20 lakhs yeah. and 30 lakhs like that mm. but we are not taking even single rupee for dealership okay yeah Ab above all we are also training them in sales mm. and mechanism wise okay so what is the initial amount and how many vehicles they should trading, uh, take in the first lot each Not mode uh, we are having now present uh, four models okay and each model two uh, because two, two uh, eight weight vehicles is enough because four models they have to keep in demonstration purpose okay. and four models just eight eight enough done and uh, uh, remaining all they can purchase whenever they want okay. so with a small amount they can start okay so as you are offering dealerships pan india what about the service part yeah service parts are in telugu states we are near we are at hyderabad manufacturing unit mm. this is not assembly unit please yeah. re re recognize this okay. we are the manufacturers of loaders we are mm. the pioneers of loaders okay. and any part or battery battery also we are manufacturing cells only we are importing yeah because uh, in lithium ferrophosphate uh, there is no any manufacturing in india that's yeah. the reason we are only one part we are bringing remaining in loaders we are the manufacturer and pioneers mm. and uh, service wise as you asked rightly asked mm. and within 24 hours in telugu states and uh, 48 hours in south india 72 okay. hours in pan india okay. we can send already we have contracted with this uh, uh, couriers and transport within 72 hours you will provide the each and every part of the vehicle pan india yes okay yeah. done. thank you sir thank you so now let's meet uh, the managing director of this call on ev and let's discuss each and every single specification of this four electric models with him so friends here we have the managing director of this call on ev mr suresh babu sir so let's have a chat with him and let's know the technical specifications of this four electric scooter models hi sir how are you yeah i am fine thank you okay so basically i took the overall tour of your factory and i loved it so basically i want to know the each and every technical specification of all the four models so let's start with this basic model first actually we we have we are making these four models and mm. these four models we have taken approval under the low speed category okay these three models comes under a loader category okay loader vehicles okay and this is a scooter vehicle yeah this is for the passengers 
Hmm. This is for load carrying uh, purpose we have developed. So we are using A grade battery, LF, A grade LFP batteries, okay. which gives something around seven years life. And okay. So uh, accordingly, we are also giving three years warranty. Okay. Within these three years, any service complaints or replacement is record, we will uh, replace that. Da. We will uh, service it. If not possible, we will replace that also. Okay. So like that, we are giving the very good service for this, uh, with uh, with this uh, LFP batteries. Done, done. So, so basically, these three model, three uh, these three loader vehicles, we are making in-house. Yeah. Everything, chassis and uh, uh, these uh, all other parts we are making here and uh, assembling and selling it to the market. Okay. So this is uh, this is called E load E light. Okay. This E load E light is equipped with uh, 30 h uh, 60 volts 30 h battery. Okay. This gives something around uh, 90 kilometers mileage. Okay. With this, uh, so we are selling this one at something around 75,000. 75,000. And what yeah, is this the payload is, this capacity? Is to, this is aimed to uh, courier people and uh, Swiggy, Jomato, these people are there. No? The, okay. the, uh, this vehicle is very much useful for this kind of, uh, that kind of application. Yeah. What is the payload capacity of this? This payload capacity is 150 kilometers. Okay. And the top speed? Top speed we are giving uh, 25 kilometers. Sir. Done, done. What about this? This one is we are aiming to farmers small business uh, business people okay. street vendors those yeah. people will be there no for them we are uh, uh, aiming okay so this one we are selling at uh, i mean we are giving at uh, 30h and 36h uh, okay 30h we are selling at uh, something around 80000 okay and uh, this 36h uh, we are selling something around 90000 okay what will be the ranges in both the variants so 30h will give something around 75 kg uh, 75 kilometers okay and uh, um, uh, 36 will give something around 90 kilometers Okay, and what the payload capacity of this? This payload capacity is 2000, uh, 200 kilo, uh, 200. 200 kgs. Okay, done. And this is? This is the E-Load Plus. Okay. This is, we developed with uh, 60 volts, 48 h Okay. Keeping in view of, uh, so heavy load carry. Yeah. This payload is its payload is 250 kg. Okay. And uh, so this this can this can give uh, this is aimed to some uh, farmers. Okay. And uh, business people yeah. and some other uh, street vendors where some heavy loads is required to carry. Okay. So this mileage we are giving this 48 volts 48 volts battery. Hmm. This gives something around 105 kilometers. Okay. So this we are selling at 110 kilo 110000. Okay. And we can also give at a low battery at low price. Okay. Like 30 h something around 85 90000 85 90000 rupees also we are selling. Okay. So as per the customer preference you can modify the battery yeah, price. As per the customer preference we can modify. Okay. That. What about this? This is Elasin. This is uh, uh, aimed to some uh, old age people, okay. ladies, okay. and some other people, uh, some office bound people, we okay. are aiming them. Okay. And this we are giving at 30H and 36H. Okay. This also will give something around 75 km mileage. Okay. 30H mileage, 75 km. Hmm. And 36 will give something around 90 km. Okay. So this one also we are selling at uh, some uh, 80,000 and 90,000 like that. Okay. So all the four models are low speed models. Yeah, all the four speed, uh, all the uh, four models. Okay, done. Thank you, sir. Right, thank so, friends, as you saw, these are all the technical specifications of all the four models in this call on EV. So, that's it for today's video, guys. So, we took the whole factory tour of this call on EV and we got the information about the free dealership opportunity. I'll give you the contact details and location of this factory in the description. So, if any one of you interested, you can contact them directly. So, that's it for this video. If you have any further doubts on this topic, please let me know in the comments. And if you found the video informative, please hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe Electric Vehicles India. Go green. Go electric.